Hi guys, it's Miss Z. Okay, so I have a few minutes this morning to record some cool things that's kind of a, a follow-up from when we were in quarantine. And, you know, I hated being inside. And so I just started experimenting with plants on my deck and I made a video about chopping off the top of a pineapple. Okay, like we grilled pineapple, I chopped off the top and then I replanted the top part to grow another pineapple plant, okay? So I wanna say that I did that in March or April, I can't remember when, but I replanted that pineapple thing and I wanna show you what the plant is doing now, okay? It's so awesome, I'm so excited. This has been so much fun to watch and grow, but look at this thing now, okay? Isn't that nuts? Isn't that fun? Okay, so this is, hello. So this is my pineapple plant that I planted during quarantine, okay? It's still growing, which is so fantastic, okay? Now, I honestly think it takes a year or two for like new pineapples to grow on it, but now my goal is to keep this thing alive during the winter. So I'm probably gonna bring it into our classroom and try to keep growing it, but for those of you who are at home, I want to show you the completely awesome pineapple plant that grew from just that cut off top that I replanted. Okay. Now Chance, he sent me pictures. He's still at home. He sent me pictures of his pineapple plant and his pineapple plant is going nuts too. It is growing so awesome. And so I am going to show a picture of that hopefully at the end of this video, or if not, I'm going to somehow find a way to get it to you. Okay. But the other thing that I want to show you, and I'm pretty sure I have been showing you during quarantine. Okay. Uh, like me and Elizabeth just planted like a bunch of vegetable seeds, like just in random pots around the deck. Now, why Miss Z can't have a garden? Because I want to show you. Okay, so I live in the woods, okay? And my deck is high up off the ground, okay? So you can see our house, our rental house and our pool in the back, like right there. Okay, but there are deer everywhere and they're super tame. Like they come right up to you but they eat any flowers, any plants that are on the ground. So Missy cannot plant like a regular garden or the deers will just eat it up. So all I have is my deck. But listen, some of you guys live in an apartment. Um, some of you are, aren't are able to like dig a bunch of dirt, a garden in your yard. Uh, but pots are just such a fun way to be able to grow things. Okay, so I gotta position my phone back. So anyway, so what I wanna show you is that Elizabeth and I, we planted a bunch of vegetable seeds in pots over quarantine, okay? And some of them made it, some of them did not. Okay, but I gotta show you one thing that did make it. So we planted carrots in a flower pot, okay? Now I gotta show you, because this is super cool, okay? So here is my pot of carrots. And so just think of this as like one of those really fun toy videos that like the unboxing videos. Well, anyway, we are going to pull up carrots and see what happens to them, okay? So here's my carrot pot, all right? And so now I'm gonna pull up my first carrot, okay? Are we ready? Can we see this? I've gotta grab it from the root. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Ah, my carrot, isn't that awesome? Okay, now what I can do, I can take this inside and I can wash it. I'm gonna like brush all this stuff off. Okay, I'm gonna get all the hair because this is kind of what it looks like. What do you think these things are, guys? These are roots. Okay, the roots to the carrots, but that was kind of what was holding it into the soil. Okay, so I'm gonna see if I have any more carrots. So here's one, okay. Elizabeth has already pulled a bunch out, but she's not here today. So I'm gonna just finish this off, okay? So I can have fun showing you this video. Okay, so here it is. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh gosh, okay. Oh, isn't that cute? So that's a baby carrot. Okay, so that's a baby carrot. Um, Let's see, let's see what this one is. Oh. Here's another kind of babyish carrot. I would say this is more like a medium sized carrot, okay? Look at how many carrots I got. And we've already got a bunch of. Ooh, now these carrots, mm, I don't know what quite to think of those. Okay, now here, see, they're under the dirt. Okay, see how fun that is? And then now I'm gonna, I gotta, 
I gotta do both hands here on this one. Okay, oh, here's another carrot. Look at that. Do you think I could have this with some roast tonight? Okay, oh, look at this one. Oh, that's a little teeny weeny baby carrot. Okay, oh, I still got some of these things. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, they're getting smaller and smaller. And I'm not quite sure why. Oh, look at these. Okay, they're still edible. We can still eat them. We have to clean all the roots off. Okay, so what I'm probably gonna do with these is clean them up and take them into class tomorrow and let everybody eat them and see. But if you are at home, gosh, I can't, hold on. I can't encourage you enough, y'all, to plant seeds. Listen, this year we are gonna talk about quality of life, okay? And I wanna tell you, just because you have a disability does not mean that you have to sit on the couch and watch videos all day, watch TV all day, never go outside, never talk to people. That is not a quality of life, okay? That, there's so much more to life than your living room. There's so much more to life than your video games. Get outside. And one fun thing that you can do is plant things like Missy did. I can't even plant a garden, but I can put seeds in a plot. And you know what? This has given me something to do in quarantine. It's made me get outside. It made me water them. It made me take care of them. And it's so fun to watch them grow and then to like have them all come out. Okay. So anyway, so there is my lesson for today. And you want to see my little doggy that's barking? Look at this. This was another thing that happened during quarantine. Look, we got a little puppy. Oh, she's so sweet. Her name is Daisy. Can you say hi to everybody, Daisy? Hi. Okay, Missy loves you guys, and I just want you to have the best quality of life that you can have, okay? And I want you to get outside and enjoy God's wonderful creation. Anyway, you guys have a great day, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.